Well, this has a potential impact for many, many thousands of people. Catania Airport normally has about 200 flights a day coming in and out. Um, and we've already seen the impact this morning in flights from London that were due to leave um, very early this morning, 6.30, 7 o'clock. The likes of Ryanair, EasyJet and BA um, have all been told that the minimum time until they will be allowed to take off is not until about 8 o'clock this evening. So a significant delay for a lot of people. In terms of your rights, unfortunately, because this is an, um, something that's outside of the airline's control, they cannot control Aetna from erupting. Um, there is no compensation due. You are still entitled to be looked after. After. So that would involve food and drink vouchers, should that be necessary. And also, should you be made to stay overnight, then the, the airline should be looking to make sure that they provide you with hotel accommodation. Now, obviously, that's not going to be that easy at this time of year. Obviously, places are very busy. Um, it might be a case that you might have to actually do that yourself, book it yourself, and make sure that you make a note of all of the expenses, keep all receipts, and make sure they're reasonable. There's no point trying to dine on champagne. You've got to make sure they're reasonable if you want the airline to actually give you your money back. I think really a good thing to do would be to download an app like Flight Radar that gives you a really good overview of what's happening at Catania, telling you exactly what flights are going in and out, and making sure that you've got up-to-date details of your own flights app um, so that you can see exactly what's going to be happening. Make sure that your airline has your up-to-date details so that should they be sending you text messages or emails, they're sending it to the right place.